Hello, it's Lord of War 2006, and I got a pretty cool Beretta here. I got it back a few months back uh, when they were running sales. They're still running sales on these, so you can still catch them every now and then. Um, this is a pretty good deal on this one. It came with, basically it's a Beretta APX and OD Green Optic Ready. It came with three 21 round magazines and a uh, $100 rebate, and it was $449 before the rebate after the rebate it should have been 349 however beretta hasn't sent me my rebate yet it's been a while they said they sent one then they canceled that one because i told them i never got it they said i got it now they're sending a new one we'll see how that works out and it still takes 10 weeks too by the way so uh here's the beretta apx tactical um it's the full size obviously they got a Smaller version of this too, but I like the 21 run mag in the full size. Came with three mags, made in Italy. So they're nice mags. This has the four plate extenders, steel mags, black fowler. Um, this also is a uh, similar to the SIG uh, 3P20, as in uh, it has the uh, changeable modular like trigger the actual component of the gun that's the firearm for the united states actually comes in and out so you can change these uh frames relatively easy i think they're under 70 dollars maybe 50 i can't really remember but they come in gray black uh obviously od green and fde i believe there's like three or four different colors it's not quite as uh popular as the sig where you got different companies that provide different lowers for them, such as like Wilson Combat and all that. I would really like to get a SIG one day, but I just haven't got to it. Like I said, uh, I know it's been a while. I apologize for not making any content, but my camera was not working. It decided to work again. So uh, we'll see how many videos I can do. And uh, yeah, so uh, the trigger pull roughly, I'm gonna say, Probably about five and a half, maybe six pounds. I might be exaggerating, but the, the re let's see. reset's right about there. And there's the trigger pull again. But uh, yeah, it's a pretty cool gun. I'm glad I got it. Um, I got a lot more coming to the channel, obviously. Um, I did take this out and shoot it. It felt good. The only thing that I really didn't really... Well, I wasn't really impressed by is this slide i don't really know exactly what it's made out of but it looks funny to me like um i don't know why it looks funny but it looks like i, I can't even explain the look i've seen lots of slides and it it looks it's either the finish on the gun or the material that they made it out of and this thing is chunky you better believe it. it's chunky but uh it's, it's a nice weight in your hand it feels like it would uh it would it would be there for the long run and uh, you got to remember, this was in the military trials when it was going against the Glock and the uh, SIG. This is what Beretta put forward, what they wanted. And uh, being that it's the tactical version, it came with the threaded barrel and the suppressor sights, which uh, hopefully one day I'll, I'll have one of those. So um, this is just something short and sweet. And by the way, it did come with a couple different back straps. It came with a small, a large, and a medium. I believe I have the medium on there right now. But uh, yeah, I like it. And uh, the range was good. It was great. It shot pretty good. But uh, yeah, just trying to stack onto my handguns. This is one that I chose. I thought it was a pretty good deal for the price. Could be passed up. It does have a little bit of funky disassembly. I don't know if it's optional, but there's a button back here. You can push that like when you cock it like this. Let's see if I can find something real quick that will be able to push that. Uh, right here so you can see this little tab back here you push that and see how deep it went down in the hole then I guess you rotate this somehow and it, it all comes out but if you release it or even mess with it a little bit it'll pop back out but that, that's just releasing the trigger I think of the catch component in there so you can disassemble it but I'll uh, watch some videos on that but if you really would like a Beretta and you wanted something in the cheaper end i mean you couldn't beat this i mean there was lots of glocks lots of everything out there you getting 321 round mags i mean this is damn there compared to uh 
dagger prices, PSA dagger prices for uh, what I got this for. So, uh, hope y'all liked it. Definitely going to add some more guns to the collection, to the channel. I'm going to try to do some more shooting and get out with them and make some more videos. Just trying to get these videos out right now. Show some updates, some of the stuff I got. Keep you guys, try to put you back into the light of where I'm at. Well, this is Lord of War 2006. Y'all have a nice day.